Hello gamers, I'm Mortuari and welcome back to another episode of Conan Exiles and today, today we will be doing some more building. We finished the bank last time and I think today it's time to expand our artisan square and add a little shop for uh, an armor. And the reason is, yesterday I went some uh, troll hunting with Scott and we found a named armor. So I want to see what she gets us and I want to uh, put her up in a shop. So let's jump straight in. I'm not quite sure how I should be continuing. Do I make it one level higher? I think it's probably not a bad idea. And this, all the other foundations should be a balcony area. So with a little overhang, I think I will be making it one level higher. But if I do make it one level higher, I will need stairs somewhere. Stairs heading up. So I know what I will be doing. I'm going to be putting up a second level. No, no, what am I doing? Um, destroy this. I'm going to be wasting materials again. Ah, this will look ugly. This will look very ugly. <laughs> Ceilings is what I need. I think the bars are in that direction. Come on. Yeah, this looks correct. So now I need the triangles. I brought only one. How silly can you be? Let's see how that looks. If I put a pillar underneath this one. And another pillar underneath this one. That kind of... Wastes some place though. Yeah, it looks more sturdy, but... Uh, not really what I had in mind. So I'm going to be closing this up. Ah, oh, done. <laughs> I knew it was going to happen. I want it to be aligned with this. Yes, like that. Now I have a little triangle in here. Yes, please. Then have it like that. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I think that's correct. Yes. I didn't make a mistake, right? No, I didn't. Good, 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 good. Another one in here. This can get annoying. Having these tiles line up perfectly. It can be very annoying. But once you learned how to do it, you can't you can't really live with your tiles not being aligned. <laughs> Actually this looks kinda ugly. I prefer the tier 3 materials for uh, ceilings. I have a stair left, yes I do. And I will be Putting up the stair here, I think. Yeah, why not? Come on. No, no, no. Yes. There. Perfect. And now I can finish up this gap by putting up some ceilings, which go like this. Another ceiling. Oh no, I will be leaving that open. And now I can finish this up by having my triangles be aligned. Something like that, yes. I need windows, that's for sure. I need windows and I need uh, fences. So let's pick up some windows and some fences. I need about, uh, let's say, 10 windows. I will need 
quite a few fences. So this is what I want to do. I have fences up here. Of course, going outer, 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 outer. So I have a little balcony. Just as with uh, the, just as I did with the the blacksmith shop, actually. And this is the last one. Yes. So the rest will all be walls and windows. Which means I should probably put up a door somewhere here. Which means this will be a window. Yeah. Let's start with that. So a window. No, a window. Correct. Another window. Yes, a wall, a window. Let's put wall, window, wall, window. So this will be a door, which means this will be a window. A wall, a window. A wall, a window. A wall, a window. A wall, and a window. And the rest will be all walls. So let's fill up the walls. Out of face. Oh, I have no more walls. What did I do? Oh, I put up a window. Darn. Not what I want to do. To do it's these I need. Yes. Outer. 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 And outer. Outer. And this will be a door. Yes, perfect. Maybe I should try to expand it one more. I have no idea what, what's under, underneath here. All triangles? Yeah, yeah, I could maybe do that. Enlarge it with a few triangles if I can. Yes. Yeah. The arbor has a little bit of bigger balcony. Actually, I think the size of the balcony is, is pretty much the same. The house is just a lot better, bigger. It's like two blocks all around his balcony. And I think the blacksmith is about the same thing. Go ahead, Record Tech. Post your question in the chat. And I will do my best at answering it. Yeah, two blocks. This one will be two blocks as well. Nice. So yeah, we have our little armor shop. I need to place the roofs, of course. It still needs its roofs. So in here I need to do the same thing. I'm gonna have to play around with triangles and circles. So this is a triangle. No, it's the triangle. Yes. Yes. Come on. Yes. It's a triangle too. Yes. I think that was a triangle too. Yeah, it looks like a triangle to me. Yes, I'm, I've been saying triangles. Of course, it's squares I'm placing. If you get back to the stream, you, you will get used to that. I'm mixing <laughs> triangles and, and squares. Mixing them. No. Oh, yeah. It, so in my case, I won't be able to make it a pointy roof. It will be impossible. The main reason is because, well, it's an uneven blocks, uh, number of blocks wide, so I will have a flat area at the top. There's nothing I can do about that. I will have to live with that. Yeah, I know you're hungry again, probably. Oh, crap. And of course the food is on the other side of our little encampment. The food and the drinks are, are getting annoying. I've been into gaming for ages now. I think the very first game I ever played, well, the very first game I remember, probably still not uh, the correct way to say it, the very first game I, I bought myself, let's call it like that, was back in the days of my Commodore 64. Oh, God, I love that machine. I really did love that machine. Thank you. Thank you, Omer. Uh, that's, that was the main idea. I'm... 
uh, I, I won't call myself a, a superb gamer, nor am I a superb builder, but what I have tried to do is uh, make this as realistic as possible. And yeah, I think I'm, I'm, I did quite fine on that. It's looking alive. I'm hoping it will get better even. Um, still have a lot to learn on, on the whole building stuff. But yeah, I'm trying to make it look as true to reality as possible. The only exception is probably our bank. Uh, our bank is probably not as safe as a bank should be. Come on, put it up there, you fool. Okay. Okay, am I done? Yes, I am done. Good. I kind of like my building. It looks better than the than the blacksmith shop. So, record tech, no, no PvP up here. Uh, we might at some point maybe have some challenges, some, uh, uh, well, maybe also an, an, an arena type of thing where we can do some PvP. Oh, this is a huge balcony, actually. It's a very big balcony. Let me show you the whole thing. From the top here, we have a nice vantage point, a nice viewpoint. You can see the whole, well, stronghold, which is turning into a big city, actually. So this is where it started. Well, actually, we started somewhere else on the map. And then I went to uh, adventure and explore, and I found this area, and I had... Uh, the idea of building a little stronghold. So I built this thing there, this gatehouse. This was supposed to be a little area closed up. But then I started extending and trying out other things and, and I have a big wall around uh, this settlement now. And yeah, we, we are starting to think of making it a, a little city, a little medieval city. So this is the bank. The building with the two towers, uh, with the two roofs is the bank, where you see the two dancers dancing on the balcony. That's the whole bank, the bank of our city. Then we have the blacksmith shop next to the bank. Uh, this area house here at the bottom is actually the, um, the tanner shop. And we have room for something else. So I think I will be putting some, uh, some cooks in there. And up there is a new building we have made, which is the armorer shop, which we will be finishing pretty soon. Up here, we will probably be building a, a big tower or a keep or whatever. But okay, let's concentrate on the task at hand. Still need to finish this up. Uh, what I will be doing is put up stuff downstairs. Because I think an armorer's shop needs at least a blacksmith, a forge, a tanner, and, of course, the armorer's thing, armorer's bench as well. So, the blacksmith. The blacksmith, I'm hoping to be able to place that under the stairs. If not, then I will have to cover that. Oh, actually, the tanner can go in there. Okay, the tannery. Come on, seriously? Overlapping with another object. You probably mean with with the stairs, right? Not enough contact with the ground, yes. So this is overlapping with another object. Why? Why oh why? Hey, they are slaves. I tell them to work under the stairs and they will work under the stairs. Uh, the armorer's workbench can go in here because, well, that's the main, the main thing in this uh, armorer's shop. Why is it overlapping with another object? What the? What the, what the <sighs> Stone brick wall. How can I? This is starting to drive me insane. Oh really? No, you will be placing? Not enough contact with the ground. Overlapping with... Uh, Jesus. OK. 
Okay. And let's start with some interior decoration. Not that we have put up our uh, people behind the counter. Let's check. If I put it like that, it will be too close, right? Yeah. So let's do it like this. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, no, no, that's too close. Maybe I should just do it like this. For the customer, that should be enough, enough room. And the thing I have been doing with the shelves is this. Yes. Oh, actually, I should have done it like that. How many will I be able to fit in? Can I fit in three? Probably not. I can. Let's remove this one then. Put up this one. Yes. Put up this one. Yes, 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 yes. And now cover up this side as well. There, I can put up some shelves up here, maybe. Somewhere up here. And maybe two more. Two more up here. I wish you, there was uh, stuff ava available like like weapon racks and, and, and similar things so that you could uh, maybe have some weapons and armor on display somewhere or maybe even if you could place uh, weapons and armor on these things on tables or something just to make it a little bit more realistic. First of all let's put up some uh, some torches on the outside. I think one on each side of the door should do. There. Seriously. And this is starting to annoy me. Why? Why? You're the one messing with the torch? idea. <clears throat> I definitely need some torches on the inside too. Yes, one here and definitely one in this. <clears throat> Maybe somewhere up here. Overlapping again, overlapping again. Everything is overlapping. Why? Not like there is... Oh, oh, I had you for a second. Oh, come on! Ooh, that's too high. The roof will burn. There, which gives a little bit of additional light. Yeah, candles. Candles. What can I do with the candles? Uh, put another candle. Turn it around a little bit. Actually, can I put candles on the... On these? Oh yeah, I can. Let's give this guy some light. There. Can I do that with the blacksmith as well? The blacksmith probably needs a... A black candle somewhere. Yeah, nice. Let's check what I can do with the carpets. 
Can I put a carpet here in the entrance? Oh yeah, I can. Nice. Nice. Okay, okay. We are getting somewhere with the decoration. What? Really? Really? <sighs> Just when I thought I had a great idea of putting some more carpets up here and then put carpets up there, then... Okay, it's not gonna happen. Okay, uh, interior decoration. I was kind of thinking of maybe putting up a little uh, round table here. Let's check how big it is. Add some stools. Yeah, why not? Give them a little area to rest. To sit down, have a chat. What can I do with these? I can turn them, raise, lower. Uh, can I do other stuff? No, I can't. Mm. I should have probably put something up here now. <laughs> um, I'm gonna check if I can put up this. Four. Wait, oh, four. Oh, it's big. It's way too big. Okay, uh, here. I have room for some of these. Five. There. Oh yeah, this is starting to look actually pretty darn cooked. Let's put up one like this. And one like this maybe. Let's see how big it is. Yep, some candles maybe. like that. One like this and one like that. Yeah, why not? Let me sit on it. Yeah, this is looking good actually. Maybe have a, a little light here just in case. No, we should put up, it up here. That's why we have some lights for late evening barbecue as well. Oh, I think it would be looking so cool. I need some standing torches. That's what I need. Standing torches. Okay, well, I think it's time to wrap up today's episode. We have been doing a lot of stuff today. We got some trolls, did some building, did some gathering, tested a few things out and built the armorer's shop. Let me show you how that looks. So we set it up right here. We have a little armor at the entrance already. Uh, I will fence this off just as I did with the blacksmith area, I think. Inside we set up our counter the way we used to. We have all stuff in here to uh, create armor. We have our smelter, the tanner and the armor. Yeah, she's still getting her will broken. We have the blacksmith upstairs. I made a little bedroom, twin bed some uh, how do you call that tables side table with uh, some candles on a little chair to put your clothes on when you go to bed a little chair to read a book with some light not quite sure what i will be doing on this side 
but we will see that later on. Outside I have a nice little balcony. I still need to put up some standing torches everywhere, but I did put up a table and some benches so that we can have a little barbecue when, uh, when we have the time to do so. So, I think that will wrap up today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button and share the video as you feel fit. Check out the description. That's where you will find links to the social media pages, links to the Patreon page, links to the other crazy folks and creative misfits guys, and links to other stuff that's interesting for the channel. While you're there, also feel free to subscribe to the channel. Not only do you help me reach my next subscribe goal, but you will also get notified when I post new content to the channel. That being said, I'm going to be wrapping up today's episode. Until next time, have fun and stay safe. Bye.